Hey guys, how's it going? It's been a while. Hope everyone's staying safe during this whole coronavirus pandemic. It is such a horrible situation. I know there's so many families affected, so many people affected. And I do pray that, you know, um, all the persons who are currently in the hospitals and currently suffering right now have a speedy recovery and are able to get back to their families as soon as possible. Anyways, let's get on to this video. So I started back playing my favorite sport lawn tennis a few months ago and ended up getting about two or three sessions in before having to stop playing altogether once again. This was of course due to our government having to put measures in place in order to curb the spread of the coronavirus. Being of course disappointed, I decided why not do what I always wanted to do since I was much younger, build a robot. And uh, not just any robot, but a tennis robot. So I could still play tennis on a court without the need for another person on the other end. Basically, the plan is to control the robot with my smartphone from the other end of the court and have it powered using batteries. So I figured I'd take you guys along with me on this journey and let's see how far we get. I'll be certainly checking out you guys' comments as we go along for any suggestions on how to improve the build. Alright, let me stop boring you guys with my rambling and let's get on to the video. Okay, so basically the balls will be collected here. Then the rotating mechanism will take the ball and send it down here. Then from there, the ball will travel by a tube to here and then be shot out through here the rotation is going to true well the rotation of the mechanism for the balls is controlled by this motor here the rotation for the main unit itself is controlled by this motor here and the rotation of the angle or the control of the angle i should say is controlled by this motor here and finally, the spinning of the actual motors that will shoot the ball is controlled by these two DC brush motors here. Yep, so that's basically it in terms of the, um, well that's the basic um, explanation, basic breakdown of how the machine is supposed to work. It will be controlled using Arduino um, as my platform, as that one is the simplest one to kind of get used to. It has a large community and there are a lot of people who can help you out on the um, community website. So yeah, that's it. That's it for the um, simple breakdown of the tennis machine. Hopefully it turns out as good as, you know, I think it will. <laughs> as usual, if you have any questions, comments or suggestions, please feel free to leave them in the comment section below. Anyways, thanks for watching guys. Take care and see you all in the next one.